Hi, uh, my name is Yudi Wang, and I'm from uh, iMotors product team. And let me introduce our vehicles. So this is a new launch? Uh, yes, this is a new launch of uh, IML7 2024. And you can see this vehicle, it has a uh, Brembo, Brembo fixed calipers. Nice. And our brand uh, focuses on driving experience. The 0 to 100 kilometers acceleration is only 3.87 seconds. And the braking distance from 100 kilometers per hour to zero is only 33 meters. And also this vehicle is equipped with rear wheel steering with a 12 degree angle of rear wheel steering. The turning radius will be 5.4 meters, which is close to Polo. It's a very large car, but the turning radius is uh, as, small, as small as Polo. So I see a lot of yeah. uh, sensors up there. What's happening? Those two are LIDARs, which is used for uh, autonomous driving. And you see the one in the center, it is called car log. Let me show you. So you need to cut. Uh, let, let me check. I'm not very familiar with this. Your catalog is a 12K camera, which can rise and uh, record. And in China market, it will send uh, high resolution uh, photos and uh, videos directly to your phone and you can upload it. Wow, 12? 12? 12K. It's 12K cameras? Con yes, it con consists of three 4K cameras. Panoramic video? Yes. All around? All, all around. I also think. behind? No behind, but uh, in all the All in the front. That's amazing. Yeah. 12K directly to your friends. It would be nice if you can upload directly to Baidu Maps or Google Maps, you know? Uh, so they can make, they can update the, so that people can drive those around. They don't need to wait for Google to update the Google Maps. Yeah, but, but in China, you know, there's no Google, so we can put on our local media. Baidu, Baidu uh, Maps. Yeah, actually we have a app, which is specially designed for IM users. See, there is a um, blog there, you can, up, 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 Upload it. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. uh, I can film you uh, in there. Uh, maybe can you sit in the cockpit yeah. on the other side? Oh, maybe he will go. Yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah. So now, yeah. A car, A car log. So my, my colleague is uh, showing how to open catalog. Okay, it's okay. Uh, no, 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 no. So uh, sorry, it's a it's a prototype vehicle, so the 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 software is not ready. But it comes out. Yeah, but it it comes out. Wow. What happened on the roof? You Just mean, sunroof. Yeah, the sunroof. It's a three-layer silver glazing roof. Maybe you can go inside. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can you start filming? Yeah, I'm filming. Okay. So if you want to close your door, you just uh, press the brake pedal and the door will close automatically. Nice, only for the driver. Only for the driver's side, but uh, all of the four doors has soft close function, which means you just need to put it here and then it will lock automatically. Nice, all right. And you can see all the lasers is a semi analog laser, which is a very good laser. Nice, very good leather. This yeah. is extremely comfortable. Also, the whole vehicle is equipped with 20 speakers. There are also two speakers 
in the seat back. And when you are driving, for example, when you are driving and you are listening to the music, when the uh, map tells you to turn right, then you, the voice of your music will lower. But uh, in IML7, the voice of the map will come to those two speakers in the feedback and which will not influence you to uh, hear the music. This screen is huge. Yeah. And Those screens, they move or no? As they move, they can move uh, separately or oh, wow. all together. And they can just move partly and fully. That's cool. Uh, two level, high or low. High or low. Yeah. Wow. So you can move it just exactly at the height based on how tall you are. And maybe your seat can go up and down also. Yeah, if you want to look over the screen or just leave them up and leave them make them smaller yeah well. it's up to you you can customize the modes so big screens and uh, is there a smart voice assistant yes uh, we are developing a smart voice assistant for more languages but for now it's only in Chinese how does it work uh, this is a prototype let me check if it's work 你好自己. Uh, so now I'm asking him to open the door window. That's awesome. So I'm asking the yeah. put it forward. The, the seating. Can, can you just say uh, to the assistant that you want to go to sleep and he should drive you home? Uh, because uh, not yet, right? Because it's a Chinese version, we do not have a signal, network signal, so I cannot show you the navigation. But um, does it have self-driving system? Of course. FS FSD, full self-driving. Uh, uh, for now, in China market, we have a, a, a function which is similar to FSD. It's a, it's called uh, a city NOA and highway NOA. Uh, basically, it's door to door. It will uh, automat automatically drive in the urban area, also in the highway area. But uh, it's L2 function. You must uh, put your hand on the steering wheel and uh, you have to look at the road. But it will drive in automat automatically. Is the software update going to bring L5? Uh, you mean? You just put a software update in the future and it will be full L5 self driving. Uh, possible or not possible? Actually, iMotors is uh, one of the companies in China who get the first license to have an L3 level autonomous driving test on the road. We are a leading automatic driving company in China, but we still have a lot of work to do to reach L5. For now, it's only L2, but we are developing L3. So let's go outside again here. Um, um, What is the L3? The L3... Uh, it doesn't mean you can sleep. Not uh, yet. Uh, you can. The you vehicle can. will quit. If, it, uh, if, uh, it's, if some situation occurs, the vehicle will uh, stop. And, the, and when it is operating, you can do something else. Really? Really. You that can sleep. You can sleep. You can sleep, but uh, maybe something, uh, some bad thing occurs, the vehicle will stop. It's, it's not uh, like you sleep for the, uh, I don't know how to say it. Nice. <laughs> you can, you so, uh, so to be honest, uh, your opinion about this car yeah. is better than every Tesla available? Uh, actually, I am a L7 user and I'm, I'm definitely loving it. Definitely? Yes. No, no question? No question, because the uh, styling, and also we have our lovely ISC screen in the back. It has over a thousand LED bulbs, which can show different animations. Nice. It's it can show, car. check out Charbax on YouTube. Uh, Maybe. We, we Advertising. Don't have the, the, the function. Okay. And when you are doing autonomous driving, it will show auto driving in the back. There's multiple plugs? Yes. Because we are bringing a China version, we need an adapter. But later, for the overseas version, we will have different charger ports. Tesla charger? 
That's the charger we are developing for NA markets. We are going to Mexico. Maybe Probably. just for the adapter it's work, right? Uh, yeah, of course in the uh, overseas market we will develop different chargers so we don't use uh, about adapters in the future. So, um, so basically what you're telling me in China, the, the EV brands make better product than Tesla already. The question is how is the price compared to Tesla? We cannot reveal the price yet, but uh, uh, I think uh, uh, on the product level, we are far more ahead than Tesla. So there is a reason if we made the price higher than Tesla. Also, you can show our glass. You see it's uh, double glass on the double layer glass on the doors and the three layer glass on the top. The NVH control is very, very good. What is the NVH? Noise, vibration, oh, and nice. uh, harassment. Yeah. The noise control you know, is very, very good. Nice. We are very confident. Very confident that you have a quiet ride and it's a very VIP experience. Yes. Feels like. When I was sitting in the back seat, it was one of the best. So be just because of the leather, the softness, or I don't know, something. Yeah. Something makes it better. And um, is there an option for normal steering wheel or you only have this kind of steering wheel? For now, uh, for overseas markets, we will give a full size steering wheel as standard. But in China market, actually 70% of our customer choose to have a half size steering wheel. And they like it? Uh, yes, you have they their like half it. size? Yeah. And uh, because, because of the, I think there are two reasons. Because one is because there is a very large screen. You can see more information. A full size steering wheel will block it. And another reason is our autonomous driving in China is very, very good, which means you do not need to turn very often. Uh, Tesla only use camera, they don't use LiDAR. And it's better to have the LiDAR? Um, I think uh, there are a lot of uh, roads of technology to achieve uh, autonomous driving, uh, both uh, camera and uh, LiDAR has its uh, own advantage and disadvantage. And the advantage is? Uh, the, it's better in the snowstorm, maybe. Yeah, maybe in a, a rain. Maybe the, when the fog is very large, the camera cannot see, but the LiDAR can see, which, which ensure your safety. You also have the normal cameras. We also have 11 cameras. It's a combination of LiDAR and camera. Is it? Uh, NVIDIA CPU. Yes, uh, it's uh, NVIDIA Orin inside. So uh, very, very powerful. Yes, the Orin is the latest uh, uh, autonomous driving chip available. How about the range? How you far are you going to go? You can see uh, we haven't done the real test for the BLTP range, but we have made our estimation. 500. Yes. It's a lot. No battery swap? No you don't want to work swap. together with NEO? Because uh, we are swapping all our products to 800 voltage platforms, which means it will only take you about 20 minutes from 30% to 80%. So in the future, the charger speed will be uh, faster. You do not need to swap your battery. This 800 volt? Uh, for now, it's 400. But uh, those two, LS6 and l 6 they are 800 voltage. Nice. How about 48 volt? You mean the small battery? Yeah, the, what do you call it? The, the, the system is inside instead of 12? Uh, for now it's 12. Yeah. How about steer, uh, steer, uh, steer by wire? Sorry? Yeah, I don't know. It's just the cyber truck. They have this weird thing where you turn. It's like a... Uh, oh, you mean the... It's like an airplane. Not yet. Not yet. But uh, you, you, your company work very fast? Yes. All we, we will consider all possibilities and uh, give our customers the best experience. Uh, when it says L7, does that mean you already do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6? No, it's our first vehicle, which is L7. Because of uh, its size, it's close to uh, BMW 7 Series. It's a large vehicle, so we call it L7. So, uh, market. Europe, 
Uh, why not just sell it now? Uh, because we haven't finished our localizations. For example, the ch charger, which is a still a uh, Chinese standard charger port. And if we want to go to a uh, UK market, we need to uh, make everything reverse because it's driving at... That's complicated, yeah, those UK guys. Yeah. But uh, the charging port doesn't sound so complicated. How, is there other things you need before you sell in Europe? Of course, a lot of regulations. Uh, the, there are different regulations in different places and it's very complicated to make all the changes. It will take time. All well, right, yeah. but right now people can buy or not uh, in right China? Right now in, in China you can buy L7, LS7 and L6 and uh, no L6 because L6 is just uh, revealed yesterday, uh, revealed today. It's the first time when L6 is bring to the customers. Yeah. What's special about this one? Um, if you can say shortly. Okay. Um, okay, we, we go to... Uh, it's a little bit smaller. Uh, yeah, so the for L6, we are going to uh, launch a solid state battery, which the WLTP range will exceed 800 kilometers. Also, the performance version, the AWD version, will have uh, acceleration 0 to 100 kilometers in just uh, 2.79 seconds. It's a really fast vehicle. 2.79? seconds to two to 100 yes all right very fast uh, very fast and also we cannot get in now uh, uh, but uh, I will tell you same as LS 6 uh, we uh, the interior is uh, fixed with uh, Napa leather the interior is also very premium and the performance is uh, very good is there a LiDAR on top? Uh, yes, this is a LiDAR. And cameras on the side and everywhere cameras all around? This is uh, 11 cameras. 11 cameras? Yes. And a solid state. That means uh, it's not wet? Uh, actually, it's no. a half solid state. Means half, half of, the, of the battery is in solid state, but another half is liquid. And it's that will be one of the first in the world? I think uh, not one of the first in the world. That will be the first in the world. The first in the world? Yes. All right. Does it, does it lower the cost of batteries to do solid state or not? It will not lower the uh, cost because uh, without massive production, the price will not be lower, but uh, it will bring our customer the best use, user's experience. How many cars uh, your brand selling every year uh, so far? Last December, we sell over 10,000 LS6 in China's market. Only in one month? Only in one month. All right, so uh, you can make you can make two, three million next year, right? Uh, yeah, we hope so. It's possible? It's easy to scale? Uh, if big demand, you just make uh, more? China market is very competitive. That's the reason why we uh, try our best to improve our products. I think people are very hungry for these in Europe, right? And in yes. the US, yes. people want this. Yes, our engineering team is working very hard to uh, bring our products to the customers in the world.